On Hella Bid, it's your boy Big Bid B, and we back for another edition of Big Bid Business. All right, look, man, so today I wanted to do something just a tad bit different. So I often talk to you guys about the fragrances that I have as I'm, you know, after I finish testing them, I review them and give them to you guys, but I never really show you, like, some of my decants. So this year, um, I purchased the decant that I've been looking at for quite some time and it's from the house of kerosene and it's called whips and roses so here's the deal I've been looking at this fragrance for months and I don't know why it's taking me so long to purchase the fragrance like I never read a note breakdown of the fragrance um, I never heard anyone talk about it uh, more so what tied me to the fragrance was its name it sounded very kinky whips and roses it just, it just did all right so i finally pulled the trigger boom and i ordered this decant so as i said i picked this up from my homies over at sensplit.com i picked up the five and metal they got it to me nascar nascar fast and they got a ton of fragrances over there just in case you don't know but uh, i've been looking at this one and aside from it sounding kinky i really thought well whips maybe that's leather and then obviously roses so Sounds like a good fragrance to me. And uh, no, no, it wasn't. No, th this is terrible. Um, I don't know if any of you guys have tried this fragrance before, but in the words of the great Big Bid B, oh, that, that, I guess that's me. This shit is shit. Like, I don't understand why you would want to walk around smelling like this. I think this rivals um, Noir Anthracite to be one of the worst fragrances of all time. All right. Um, this is terrible. This is terrible. So after purchasing this fragrance, I was able to dive into some of the notes and the note breakdown sounded good. You know, you have uh, bergamot, you have blood orange, you have uh, leather, you have roses. Um, I think you have a little uh, gardenia in there, a little lily. So it's a floral woody fragrance that should, in theory, smell good. If I had to liken this to smelling like anything, this is like... The rose note is there. It's definitely there. Boom! It's there. It's like um the roses that you, not the, the good roses that you send to your to your lady on Valentine's Day, right? These are the roses that you you send for the funeral, right? They don't really smell that good, right? They they don't smell that good <laughs> at all. All right, so this is like roses. It's like um low grade marijuana and dirt. This is not good at all. I mean, like, why would you? Why would you make this? Like, I get it, right? Some of you guys out there wear fragrances for the art. But this is trash. Like, trashbag.org is kind of where this one needs to be. And you know what really got me about this fragrance is if you log on to the site, I don't think this is readily available there. So a lot of you guys out there may not know that bond number nine is on scentsplit.com. Right, because some of you guys hit me up like, hey, you know, I've been looking for a bond, but since Split doesn't have it, well, yep, they do. You got to be a VIP customer to get access to it. And to get access to this one, you had to be a VIP customer. So I'm like, oh, this shit must be awesome. And no, I was wrong. I was wrong. Oh, my goodness. Like, <clears throat> listen, guys, I try not to steer you wrong ever. I'm going to tell you how disappointed I was with this. You have never seen me do a review on the decant like decants don't come on this channel all right we talk about bottles um and bottles all right because there's no place for things like this here and you mr whips and roses are making it any easier for other any other decants to come on this channel i mean this is terrible like i don't smell the bergamot in this at all right i don't smell the blood orange in this at all but what i do smell is the roses it's there. This is not good. Like, I've never tried anything from the House of Kerosene before. Uh, and I probably won't ever again. I mean, it's going to be uh, a lot of work for one of you guys out there to really convince me to try this thing because it's terrible. I don't remember what they charged me for this thing, but it wasn't over $50, so I had to pay for the shipping. And shipping alone is too much to pay for that. So that's what I got on that one. This one um, was a bad start to the year, and I was never even going to bring this to the channel, but I figured if I could save one person out there from buying this fragrance, then it's my duty to do that, right? Like, I try, I try to tell you guys things that smell good, right? Things that, things that are awesome, like this, smells good it's awesome right you like that this smells good it's awesome 
you like that. And even in this little thing, you know, it's a Killian. And Killian smell good and awesome. But this thing, you might play. On a scale of one to 10, you get a negative 10. I hope that didn't break because it's gonna make this room smell like that. And then it's gonna be terrible because I won't have any videos for at least three weeks until that smell gets out of here. So in other news, man, we are at 18K. We hit 18K, I don't know, a few days ago. So thank you, you know, thank you for everything that you've done. Even if you're just subscribing right now, or even if you thought about unsubscribing and you didn't do it, thank you. You know, because um, I need people like you, man. If you're rocking with me, I'm gonna rock with you. I try to be there for you all the time. But what really you guys care about is the giveaway, all right? The giveaway is coming at 20K, which is right around the corner. If you could tell a friend to tell a friend to, to come and hit the bell, we'd be there a lot quicker, all right? I'm just saying we'd be there a lot quicker because we've come up with a very unique way to do this giveaway, all right? And I think you guys will thoroughly enjoy it. Um, I don't know if I've seen a giveaway like this before. I don't think I have, um, which is great because we over here at uh, AGE Productions or Big Beer Business slash the other channel that you guys don't know about. <laughs> we pride ourselves on being different, you know, and trying new things. And this will revolutionize how the way giveaways are done in the Fergus community. As always, I'm your boy Big Beer B. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend and we back again, especially if you want to get to that 20K, and I hope I didn't hype you guys up too much about the giveaway because it does sound pretty awesome. Because it is. Now, holler my people over at Split and hit the goddamn bell.